What's up guys welcome to my channel and in today's video we will discuss that what is NFC and what is its use so without wasting any more time let's get right into today's video shall we so NFC payment system have managed to marvel the entire world with their abilities to provide for fast cashless transaction with the just a tap of a phone the number of NFC mobile mobile payment users projected as 166 million for 2018 180 million for 2019 and over 200 million in 2020 expected till now smartphone users absolutely love this quick and easy payment system brands like samsung apple google have also provided validating to efficient the payment technology nfc technology by incorporating nfc based payment system in their mobile wallets a technology that has facilitated users and brands alike is worth mulling over so what is nfc nfc is a short near com- near field communication which refers to technology that allows wireless communication between two devices using electromagnetic fields nfc being a derivative of rfid radio frequency identification technology is intended to provide a more secure transmission between the device with its reduced transmission range which is 4 cm how does nfc work now let's jump into this transmission of data via nfc technology require two nfc enabled devices a transmitting device and a receiving device like uh, for example uh, nfc tag or nfc sticker and a smartphone in case of nfc tag and a smartphone the nfc tag tag is passive device which can only transmit the data but cannot receive it whereas smartphone is an active nfc device capable of both receiving the signals from an nfc tag and also transmitting the data to the nfc enabled smartphones like for example if i have the uh, nfc sticker to my uh, and i have placed it on my wall so whenever my friend comes to my house i i just tell him to scan that nfc sticker and he just gets into my wifi it means automatically gets connected now let's discuss how to use nfc on your device if you have an iphone the latest model of iphone like uh, iphone 10s iphone 11 iphone 10a uh, can natively read a nfc tag without requiring an app while older models such as iphone 8 iphone and iphone 7 iphone 6s these are require the third party app for nfc reading and making payments but actually now apple in ios 13 apple has made an specific app which is called apple pay so all over the platform on older devices and newer devices all are right now same earlier it was not the, not the same deal nfc technology is more famous for its ab- application cashless payment like samsung pay apple pay these application work with the help of nfc now let's see how to use nfc on android device you need to first enable the nfc option in your android device first go to settings for your phone then start reading where is the nfc tag option or if you have option then search nfc it will show you then tap in on that option and boom you are into the nfc thing yeah it is so easy whereas in my phone i told you have to download the app and it is actually a little more harder than you think on apple compared to android you just in android you just go into setting search for nfc and turn on boom and you are in so now let's discuss what is the benefit of nfc what can we do nfc tag can also be linked to images galleries to help users share the photos they have clicked among their pages and business can use this feature businessmen can use this feature to display an array of product pictures that would help users make a better purchase decision like it is one of the best reason nfc is used worldwide for business things okay so now let's discuss that why nfc i mean the conclusion at the end of the day according to statistics reports nfc and other technologies are expected to generate an billion dollar in us by 2021 besides contactless payment system we can attribute that rising popularity of nfc is proximity marketing industry to its ability to deliver marketing campaigns without requiring an app so 
these all these are my these are all the conclusion and how to use on iphone and how to use on android my video till then peace out and if you do end up liking my video be sure to subscribe my channel as we are extremely close to 6000 subscribers till then peace out and i'll meet you all in the very next episode